I got a call from Sarah. She's the campus arborist, and she told me there was a cedar tree that died that Jim Cronin would like to use for his outdoor restoration. I have a crew of five guys in my shop, combined experience of about 180 years, and I'm really lucky to work with people who I really consider craftsmen. I think being able to see something finished that you built with your own hands, that chances are will be around long after you're gone, um, it's kind of a good feeling. So I got involved with this project a couple of years ago. I was doing my PhD and just felt like I wanted to do a little bit more with the University of Washington community. There was a student group of the Society for Ecological Restoration University of Washington chapter. So I started going to a few of their meetings and it was really exciting to do restoration work on campus. We all share a real passion not only for the outdoors but also taking ecosystems that have been degraded and trying to correct that and bring a lot more of the native species and ecosystem functions back to these places. Most ecological restoration can happen on really large scales, like hundreds or thousands of acres. And for a student group to have something really small like this, we can really make an impact that's noticeable. Um, and so that's very rewarding. Mm -hmm.